So the biggest news so far this week is that Samsung is holding a webinar later on this week to showcase their brand new 2021 micro, yeah, you guys heard that right, micro LED television. Now, they haven't discussed sizes, they haven't discussed really anything outside of just the general concept of a webinar unveiling the next latest and greatest. And this is exactly why I told everybody in 2020 not to buy in 2020 because the Q90T, which is a downgraded Q90R, I mean, dude, you're gonna feel so bad seeing micro LEDs come out that are basically the same price point or anything remotely close, you know what I mean? Like the technology is already coming out as far as information wise, we're hearing rumors about new mini LEDs even that are gonna be coming out. Like a lot of exciting stuff happening with Samsung specifically so far in the AV community rumor threads. I mean, it's really exciting what I'm seeing. Um, guys, I'm gonna tell you right now, it's, it's one of those things where if you've bought a TV recently and it's a Samsung or whatever it is, if you're not happy with it, I would look into returning it just because of the kind of rumors and things that we're hearing coming out of a lot of these like indie publications like The Hidden Wires. I, I'm telling you guys, like it's so cool to know that they're talking about mini LED and re re revealing it, dude. Like we're not even like in December yet and they're talking about webinars to show 2021 products. I mean, like, what and, and we can kind of expect more things like this because ces was canceled i would imagine because of what's going on right now that everybody's going crazy over right so i think it's kind of going to be one of those things where it's like a race to the finish whoever can generate the most press first wins and i think samsung's trying to jump in front of the line here and i think they're doing a good job because there's been a lot of hype towards the new quantum dot technology they have now my only question is would their micro led technology actually be viable because we know we've seen things at ces two years ago with their 150 inch walls and things like that but you know the wall technology is towards the super elite bruce wayne type you know you're like filthy rich right most people don't own the wall and could never hope to afford that because it's well over a hundred thousand dollars so i i think if this is their mini led technology that they're showing off next week or later on in this week i i think Guys, that's a waste of our time. I think that's kind of like more gimmicky BS. But honestly speaking, if it's something viable, if they show something cool, like, hey, we have 43 inches and 55 inches and, oh, guess what? 32 inches, because apparently that's a screen size that nobody cares about anymore. I, I think if they show cool things and how modular mini LED could be and how cost effective that would make it, I think that would be a conversation to have. But I don't know. It's just something to think about. Another thing that I've heard about is that Samsung is going to be, I don't know when, but soon unveiling their mini LED displays, which I would imagine would take over the current lineup that they have right now, at least for the 4K TVs. So I don't know if they're going to do like micro LED at the 8K level and then mini LED at the 4K level, but it's seeming like that's the direction of Samsung this year. But again, this is all rumors or these are all rumors at this point, and it could be total speculation on the part of publications. But I think it's good news. I think it's a proving piece that, again, technology is actually moving forward towards being genuinely new instead of what we saw this year in 2020, where things were literally just downgraded versions of 2019 TVs. So I think that part of it's really cool. But I want to hear what you guys say. Do you think this is more like gimmicky BS, or do you think they're actually going to show up in 2021? Or is it one of those things where you're not really going to hold your breath on it either way? I want to know. Let me know down below. Thanks for watching the number one brand in honesty. If you like videos like this, smack a like on it because it helps me grow. Until the next video, I'll see you guys later.